lovelies. So I guess today I'll tell you about my day because yesterday I just had things to say. Now I've turned into Dr. Seuss all of a sudden. Um, so yesterday I went to the post office and I was there for t an hour or two. Um, our post office is like crazy busy. I don't know what the deal is. Um, and even for the machine, it's like crazy busy. I don't know. Um, but it wasn't too bad. It just, there were some people there that were funny and I didn't mind. It was the first time I'd been out of the house since I arrived here December 1st. So that was probably why it wasn't that bad for me because it was really exciting to get out of the house for like a non-doctor appointment or emergency appointment. Um, and I got to catch up with um, one of my best friends, Monica, which is great because she's been really sick and I, you know, we were just been, like texting back and forth and like Snapchatting. But I'm telling you, like, I am getting ready to like throw my phone in the garbage disposal. Like, I swear this year has been the worst, like the biggest amount of bad news that I think I've ever experienced any Christmas season like it is just non-stop and it's just gutting to me because my defenses are already down because of being ill and you know I had a lot of crazy thoughts when I was ill it's amazing like what becomes important when you're ill like I mean before I got ill the thought of like dentists taking my tooth out and then me having to like you just like existing without a front tooth that's like that would be I would flip out and now I just like walk around and I like look at myself in the mirror and I'm like oh my gosh I'm so glad that like my face is back and I'm just healthy and I'm not as sick as I was and like I don't care if I ever get a tooth put back in there like it's so funny like the only time I put my tooth in is to do videos and the only reason I do that is because like I feel like you guys would like the appearance of it better that's the only reason otherwise I would just do them without my tooth um but yeah so anyways back to the post office story um my packages won't go out in time but um, because my grandparents don't really know what to like get me for Christmas. They actually paid for the shipping, which is so awesome. So, um, cause it is like really important to me to be able to like ship my presents out and give my presents to everybody. So that's a really awesome gift for me because that's what I, that's what I want. <laughs> um, and so that like helped a lot with being stressed about that because I, I sent out like seven or so packages I only had like my parents presents and then my present for Leanne so um those are like everything else got shipped out um uh, I'm trying to think of what else I have to tell you guys um I started watching a new show called Broad Church I think it's a BBC type show. I love British shows. Like, I love them, especially the detective shows. And that's what this is. So I started watching that. I should do a rundown of, like, all the movies and stuff I watched. Because I watched so many movies when I was really ill. Um, they were mainly Disney movies. Like, I watched Cinderella and Snow White. And I started watching Robin Hood and... Um, but I watched Maleficent, which was so freaking good. I'd been waiting and waiting to see it because I wanted to watch it with my mom. But finally I was like, I'm just going to watch it. And um, it was so different than I thought it was going to be. But it was so much better than I thought it was going to be. I thought they made a big deal out of it just because it was like Angelina Jolie. But yeah. Um, I hope we get a chance to watch my video that I did yesterday. Um, I don't know who might need to hear that, but somebody does, and I'm glad that you guys have been watching it. Um, what else? What else? 
Um, um, so I got my new Owly, um, cool gear thing. You can like put a straw in it or it can be like a sippy type cup thingy, my jig. And I really like it. My dad got it for me, which was really sweet. He got it for me when I was really sick. I was like, what my dad does, he does really sweet things by like getting really thoughtful gifts like this that have owies on it because that's what I love. What did I do here? Um, but I had forgotten about it because clearly like when they gave it to me I was I'm not exactly with it. Um, yeah. But yeah I guess like being chronically ill I kind of think that I think about the things that I'm grateful for a lot but being in like an emergency type situation where you're that ill and that scared and like don't recognize your face in the mirror um it puts things even higher into perspective of what is really important and what's taken for granted and what i'm so blessed with and um yeah things like that so i don't know it's i when I start to think about it, I get a little bit overwhelmed because it was just a cr crazy week and a half, week and t two weeks, and I'm just trying to settle into things now. So we shall we we shall see. That's hard to say. Um, I'm just uh, like having some there's like some bumps above my uh, gums. And like this side's smooth and this side has like bumps and I don't know if it's just like like scar tissue or if it's still swelling I do have pain I don't know if that's normal I don't know if you have any idea leave a comment down below besides that we have watched a couple Christmas movies and um, I was watching Lori's video and she was talking about watching videos and, um, movies, Christmas movies, and she was talking about Scrooge and how they didn't really like it, which I thought was really funny because Scrooge is one of my, well, it's, it is my favorite Christmas movie, and it's, like, one of my favorite movies, like, just period, and, um, so I was wondering what your favorite movie is to watch during the Christmas or holiday season, um, I would say, like, my top ones are Scrooge, duh. it's not Scrooge, Scrooge, duh. um, the, the Bill Murray movie, um, The Grinch, both of them, I really love the Jim Carrey one, and I love the cartoon one, and probably Elf is, like, a new favorite, but I don't necessarily love all parts of that movie, but it has such good lines in it that, like, and I just love B Buddy, the character of Buddy. It's just so cute. Um, and I love National Lampoon's Christmas. And it makes my dad laugh so hard. And then it just makes me laugh. And I just love that. So um, I have a lot of favorites. So leave your favorite down below in the comments. And give this video a thumbs up if you feel like it. I don't know if you do or not. I don't know. But I hope you're having a pain-free, stress-free day. And I hope you're having a wonderful day. And I'm sending out X double O's. And as always, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.